Does this look familiar? Clutter distraction desktop that makes it hard for you to focus on what really matters. It's time to say goodbye to distractions and hello to a rec space that works for you. Welcome to the ultimate guide to build a custom Windows 11 team that focuses on productivity. In just a few steps, we will transform our Windows experience into a productive powerhouse. So let's get started. Clutter desktop can lead to a clutter mind. Research shows that visual distraction can drain your focus and reduce your efficiency but personalized windows 11 team can create a calm organized and inspiring break space so in this video we are going to explore a few simple ways on how we can transform our workspace to productive masterpiece. So the first thing we are going to do is to clear our desktop to give it a clean and beautiful look. Sometimes if you need the files here, you can just right click on your desktop and just click on show desktop icons to hide them so that it becomes clean and it's really amazing. So after you hide them, then we'll come back to the tax bar and here what we are going to do is to clear up the things which we don't need and also add the applications we need on our tax bar to give it a beautiful and easier access to our apps. So to do that, I'll just right click anywhere on my tax bar and click on tax bar settings. Once here, what I'm going to do is to click on the search bar and change it to the search bar icon which is going to make it only a search icon over there. If you don't like it, you can also click on the hide to hide it and also with the task view i'm going to hide my and also i'm going to keep my weather icon which is here if you don't like it you can just toggle it to turn it off and here the next thing we are going to do is to bring all the apps we normally use for our productive works on our taskbar and it's pretty easy to add so if for instance i want to add vs code i can just open my start menu and drag the apps on my taskbar and it's going to be pinned over there so i'm going to pin a few more of my apps and you'll be good to go once i've pinned them the next step we are going to take is to customize our start menu for easier access of application and also our taskbar for a beautiful and minimal look and the tool we are going to use for this customization is called rainhack rainhack is a windows utility to which is used for modeling features in windows 11 which is very cool and there are two main things we are going to use over here and to get them you just have to click on the explore tab here and search for windows 11 starts menu styler so once you find it just click on details and here what you are going to do is to click on install to install it on your windows once it's installing i've provided a link to a file in the description below which is a zip file and i recommend you download it and we are going to use it in this customization so you can just right click on the zip and just extract it on the on your desktop once it's extracted you can delete the zip file and open the folder up and you are going to be greeted with three new folders inside what we are going to focus on is the config file which is going to be the configuration test files for the start menu and the taskbar so to deal with the start menu i'm just going to double click on the start menu test file and here what i'll do is to right click and select all the tests and right click anywhere to copy once copied i can go back to rainhack and here i'll go to the advanced tab and i'll select everything here clear them and just paste the new one here once paste click on save and now you are going to see that your windows start menu has been changed to this modern one which is beautiful once we are done with this we can go back to the explore tab again and install the windows 11 taskbar styler so with this, it's going to help us customize our Windows taskbar for a beautiful and sleeker look. So whilst it's installing, I'll just go back and close this file and open my folder again. And here, I'm going to open the taskbar test file and copy all the tests inside it. Once 
once copied you can just go back to your windows 11 taskbar styler then you go to the advanced tab and here select all the text over here clear them and paste the new one and here what you have to do is to click on save to get the new modern look and it's pretty cool so once we are done with this you can just close it up and we can move to step three of this customization inside the folder i provided i've provided some wallpapers which we can set on our desktop to give it a minimal and sleeker look and i'm going to select one of them and set it as my background wallpaper and i'm good to go so the next thing we are going to do is to customize our desktop and provide some skin packs which is going to make our desktop more attractive and beautiful so the tool we are going to use for this look is to install remita which is a windows skin tool which is going to provide us the ability for our desktop custom skins on our desktop and it's pretty amazing so once it's installed you can just click on finish and it's going to load its default skins and you can just right click on each of them and unload them once they are unloaded you can just open the folder up again and go to the skins and the first one we are going to install is the price down skin so i'll double click on it and click install to start the installation once done i also double click on the elegant music player and click on install now you can see these two skin packs over here and with this we can delete the folder because we won't need it again so i'll just delete it and keep my desktop clean so once here it's time for us to customize each of them to our personal view and with this clock i just want to increase the size and change the color to white so to do that just right click on the clock and here click on edit scan and you are going to see that it will be open in your notes pad so here what we can do is to change the color over here to white and the color code for white is fffff so once you've changed this to fff it's going to change the color to white and here if you want to adjust the size we can just change the size to maybe 150 and i think you can just adjust it to your personal view which is going to look perfect for your desktop so i'll just save it you can just go here and click on save and now what you can do is to just right click on it and refresh and see how it has become now i'm facing some issue here because my one is not showing well and to do and to face this issue you have to increase the y axis of the meter time so what i'm going to do is to give it 150 over here and also click on save again once done just refresh the screen and we are going to see that the day and the date is more shift up from the time and i think it's because we 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 gave it a high value so i'm going to change this one to 100 to see how it's going to be so i think this is okay the only thing we have to do is to face the one and to face that one error you can just come here and what you are going to do is to increase the y axis to maybe 190 and it might very pair your display you are using so i'm going to give it 190 and see what's going to happen and look at that mine is faced and i think this is okay for me so i'll just keep it this way and push it to the middle here the next thing we are going to do is to decrease the size of my music player over here because it's looking big on my desktop so to do that just right click on it and open edit skin again and here you are going to see scale over here with this skill you can just reduce the scale if yours is looking big to make it more small so i'll just give it a scale of 1.1 and save it and now i'll just close it and refresh to see how it's looking now and i think this is okay for me so this is it all you have to do now is to just arrange it on your desktop to make it go with the wallpaper you chose in order to give it beautiful and sleek hair look so this is it for this video and you have any question you can just comment it below and i'll reply you as soon as possible and if you really like my content then don't forget to subscribe to the channel because it really helps me a lot and keep me going thank you for watching peace out bye bye